Hi, this is Gali Gopar, and welcome to my Gorilla Life Coaching videos five times a week. I talk about a quote that can help you move your life to a better, healthier, and happier place, and I hope you gain a lot of value from these videos. Today, our quote of the day is from Nike and says, The ones who say you can't are too afraid that you will. We are social beings and we have people around us, and they say, that they want the best for us but usually as with human nature they are also caring for their own needs people around us may not favor change and would like to have you kept in the space that you currently occupy in their life they may be afraid of change for themselves and any change for you will also mean change for them and this is why people you surround yourself with are crucial for your livelihood if you spend time, even on a weekly basis, with people who are not aligned with your life goals and do not see the future as you see it, or choose, or you choose to surround yourself with people who have no goals from themselves, not because their life is perfect, but because they are too afraid to make change, then know that their mindset will also tend to become your own mindset. You will find yourself complaining just as they do about their current situation instead of taking the lead and producing change for yourself. I can understand how hard it can be, even at times impossible, to change your social environment. But for peace of mind and happiness and mental health, you definitely want to watch the day-to-day -day influences that you have on yourself. Are your day-to-day -day influences pulling you down? Are, they, are, are people around you afraid of your success? Well, if this is the case, then change is necessary. Now, I know that there are people preaching that bad relationships must be severed. I can agree with this only if the relationship is a violent relationship. But if the relationship is there and it adds some kind of value to your life, then you... and this means that you have not yet outgrown this relationship and you can stay there but there are other actions that you can take to ensure that you are still headed in the direction of your goals and that you are happy so here are three action steps that I recommend that you should take daily to support your path to a life of inner fulfillment for you now the first is to have a daily walk in nature even for half an hour a walk in nature allows you to connect with your true self, your highest nature, a being in the likeness of the Creator. And this is what you are. You are like a small rock taken off of the top of a mountain. You, uh, the small rock still has the same characteristics as the mountain, but only in smaller magnitude. Now we are all part of this higher nature, and taking a walk in nature will allow you to connect to this. Your truths will suddenly appear before you. You will become more aware of yourself and who you are and you will be stronger in mind because you have the solitude time to contemplate on important issues for you and to get you the results uh, and all of the information that you have uh, from your inner being. Uh, now the second step is to listen to the words of people who have dreamed a similar dream to your own. Listen to their lectures, listen to their talks and videos, read their books, blogs, articles, watch movies about them and read their biographies and how they overcame the difficulties in their lives and read their quotes. Do this daily and by doing this daily you allow them to form part of your environment. They become your influencers and these people should be chosen wisely since when uh, they start to form the bulk of your time, they will actually have a major effect on your choices and the way you move through life. Now the last step is to watch your thoughts. Notice what the bulk of your thoughts are and what is their nature. Are they positive thoughts or self-limiting thoughts? Are they pulling you down or are your thoughts uplifting you and moving you forward? We are always having these conversations inside our heads. Most often we are not even aware that they are going on. But there are thoughts and these thoughts are influencing us and our behaviors. When I first started to notice my thoughts, I was so shocked to see how 
negative they were in their um, they were so negative thoughts and I didn't even know I was having these thoughts and they were affecting my behaviors so and till this day there are still times when I catch my thoughts having a negative impact on me especially when I think of how I made other people feel even if and when I am stating my needs so then I have this conversation going on in my mind perhaps I shouldn't have said that or maybe I didn't think of their feelings and so on. This internal dialogue is definitely not helpful for me or for anyone and just brings us down. So I stop it and release and let go of what I did and how it may have affected others. I release my thoughts and you can do this too. Now this will make you stronger since uh, I have become also stronger since I'm doing this and I am mastering my mind instead of letting it push me to places that I don't want to be in and this you can also do this is your your job actually to master your mind because your mind is not you now this is true for every field of life our conscious mind the thoughts we are aware of must lead the subconscious mind from where most of our behaviors come from unfortunately our conscious mind is influenced by our surroundings and the people around us. And this is why it is important to ensure that you have optimistic people and believers around you. Naysayers, for most people, can have a major uh, influence on their life and choices. And there are only few people who, use, who can use the power of these naysayers to increase their motivation and to prove them wrong but for most people naysayers have a very negative self-degrading influence now removing such an influence of such people by adding better influence that comes from either within or from people you admire uh, while you are caring for the junk that is going on in your mind will help you overcome any negative influence and will help you do what you truly care for so that you can live a life that is truly worthwhile for you. Now, uh, no two people are the same. Everyone has different dreams and desires. Therefore, relationships must allow for every person's individuality to shine through. This is a must for the relationship to be happy and fulfilling for everybody. Now the quote says, um, uh, the quote of the day that we're talking about is the ones who say you can't are too afraid that you will. So don't give in to other people's fears. Life is too short. It is your responsibility to make it worthwhile for you. Do not waste your time in a place that does not move you forward in life, forward towards your goals. So as I always do with these videos, I provide you with a question that you want to ask yourself so that the answer will help you move your life to a better, happier place for you. So the question of the day is, uh, who in my life has a negative impact on my thoughts and beliefs? And how many hours a day or a week am I spending with them? And can I reduce this amount in any way? Now once you have your answers to these uh, think of people who you admire. Can you have more contact with them on a daily basis instead? Do you have books that you can read? Lessons that you can learn from them? Find a way to fill up your empty time spaces with input from these people that you admire, either by talking to them or by reading and listening to their talks. So, as usual, I recommend writing uh, the question the questions today that I stated in a notebook that you have especially for these coaching sessions so that you can look over them also from time to time to see if you're improving and also to help you move expand your life expand your consciousness and move yourself forward so the affirmation of the day that I recommend is I am focused on my purpose and I am supported I am focused on my purpose and I am supported now tell this to yourself as many times as you can because the, um, an affirmation has the power to move your consciousness forward and help you improve your life in so many ways. So I hope you liked this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. 
Please subscribe to my channel for daily uh, motivation and inspiration for you to move your life forward. And please also visit my website, thegorilladiet.com, for anything to, to help you live a healthier uh, life, more in line with nature. Thank you very much for joining. 